at the Mini Baby Bell Factory in Brookings, South Dakota, we've been learning some French. The fromage is très crémeux et onctueux, et je l'adore. Teaching some French. Je suis directeur de marketing. And throwing some cheese. We've also seen milk get delivered, tested, standardized, pasteurized, cultured, molded, and ripened. And we're ready to head back onto the production line to enjoy the final stages of the process. Indeed we are. The ripened cheese trays are unloaded, and the cheese travels through a series of fun interlocking conveyors. Uh, the staircase, to my favorite part, the waxing. You know what I've always wondered? How do they get that wax on? None of your cheese works. Okay, well, that was unexpected. Uh, let's ask the marketing guy, Adam. Adam? I just was told never to ask. Don't ask, don't tell. Gotcha, totally cool. We'll just hang out with our camera near a conveniently large window under a sign which says waxing and take a brief moment to, whoa, oh, I uh, guess not. I heard it's waxed by a team of magical French elves using only the distilled tears of rare Moroccan camels. <laughs> Actually, I think it's just a machine which waxes about 21,000 pieces an hour, but still pretty neat. <sighs> I guess we'll never know. Now let's head to packaging, shall we? Right. Well, before it's wrapped, the wax cheese is plunged into a cold water shower. Crystallization. That's what I meant. Yes, but it's not a shower. A shower is to clean the body. A crystallization is to increase the crystallization of the wax. Boring uh, 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 guy. Uh, so the cold water crystallization sets and hardens the wax. Then it's ready to wrap. Rolls of cellophane are loaded into the packaging system. And in one swift movement, the cheese is wrapped and the cellophane snipped and sealed. Two wrapping machines can process around 51,000 mini baby bells an hour. The wrapped cheese tumbles back onto the production line and is set up this staircase conveyor. Then it's dropped down a chute and into a net bag. The netting is snipped, tagged, and dropped. To be handboxed by factory workers, the cold storage room is built into a series of truck-shaped lanes for ease of loading and distribution, which is important when you produce 24 million pounds of cheese each year. So cool. We'd like to hang out longer, but well, it's cold. 